Hi, I'm Leonidas and today I'd like to take you through a step-by-step -step introduction to installing the SolarMD Logger V2. The SolarMD Logger V2 is a lightweight solution for remote data acquisition which enables users to benefit from advanced energy reports and device control. Before we begin, please make sure you refer to the instruction manual. Please follow the relevant safety precautions during all procedures. Step 1. Unpackaging Once unpackaged, you should have the following. A quick installation guide for the most common inverters, the logger itself and a Wi-Fi antenna. The package does not include a power supply since the logger is specifically designed to work with 24 to 48 volt DC battery systems and can be directly supplied from the battery buzz bar. The front of the logger provides the following information. The serial number, Wi-Fi SSID, Wi-Fi password and local IP. Step 2. Various connection options. Let's take a look at the various powering options and communication connection points. The top side has the powering options, Ethernet plugin, two USB connections and an RS-232 connection point. At the bottom side of the logger, there is two GP relays, two CAN bus ports and an RS-485 connection point. Step 3. Mounting instructions. The logger has pre-drilled holes for easy mounting. A DIN rail mounting kit is optional. For reliable operation, it is required that the data logger be located within 100 meters of an Ethernet connection and within 10 meters of the canvas connection. Step 4. Powering the logger. Connect the data logger directly to a 9 to 65 volt DC voltage source. Alternatively, you can power the logger with a micro USB power supply. Step 5. Connecting to the internet. In order to gain access to the monitoring features, the logger needs to be connected to the internet. There are two ways to connect the logger V2 to the internet. The first is to simply plug a network Ethernet cable directly from your router into the Logger V2 Ethernet Zero port. The second method is connecting the logger to an available Wi-Fi connection. In order to do this, you will need to connect your smartphone or laptop to the Logger V2 built-in Wi-Fi access point. The connection details like SSID and password are on the front of the Logger V2. Once connected to the Logger V2, navigate to the local IP address 192.168.222.1 in your browser. To log into the logger, use admin in lowercase as your username and password. Once the logger is accessed, you can connect it to the internet. In the main menu, navigate to My Devices, Logger My Power, Network, Wi-Fi. All available networks will appear. Select the Wi-Fi you would like to connect to and enter the Wi-Fi password. The Wi-Fi client tab will confirm once the connection is completed. The connection will also be verified on the logger by the network connection LED turning green. Step 6. Device registration. To register your connected device, simply scan the QR code printed on your logger using your smartphone. This will take you to the MyPower24 login page. If you don't have an account, you can simply select the Create a New Account option and follow the easy procedure to register. If you are an existing user, you can just log in and the logger will be allocated to your account. 